We are back! And we will now head to the flying machine. Alright. I do not like this boss. Well, the boss is alright. It's the stage itself. Uh, which night is this? Propeller, Propeller night. night. Oh, Propeller Night stage. Ugh. This is, what, this is one of those levels that I... That I love the theme to, but don't really like the stage as much. I don't. I this is. I haven't done the stage because um, I did Polar Night first. <laughs> so and do this that, before and, Polar Night. Yeah, and Polar Night made me RL rage quit. So yeah, I was like, fuck that shit. Yeah, Cha -cha. for context, I don't remember if I brought this up already, but I played. I had. I played this on the DS version. 3DS. Uh, 3DS. Huh? 3DS. 3DS. What I say? You said DS. DS. Whatever. As uh, if the DS well, this had this game. Work as a DS game. So I I had this on the 3DS. Uh, Polar Knight made me fucking rage quit. So I was like, yeah. Fuck Bro, that check shit. your audio. Huh? Check your audio level. Check your. My audio is fine. Yeah, you were just you were now. just low for a bit. Uh, yeah, that, in case you're wondering, because Eric, you're gonna have a shit ton of editing. Yeah. Um, Audacity is doing this stupid thing where it's lowering all our goddamn mics. And then say hello to those to the enemies with fans. Eh, yeah. stupid wind. These guys are also kind of annoying, but not as much as the guys that blow you away. So yeah, um, I do have the game again, uh, thanks to Eric. Uh, yes, I bought it for him and now he shall card. complete it. What's up? I still need to get you, uh, I still need to get your birthday present actually, DC. Yeah, and it's not gonna be No Man's Sky anymore. Although essentially... Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Although essentially his I, present for me was, I am Suchina. Thank you for that, by the um, way. Suchina. Uh, hmm. I'm not sure if I should get, um... A PS a PlayStation Plus subscription or just... A game, I don't know. Depends if he's got a subscription now. I don't have a subscription yet. This is actually a pretty clever use of the the cannons and the little yeah. uh, walls. Because pretty much your oh, clues it, are, it are where... It actually shows you what's a platform and what's a uh, yeah. fake wall. Yeah. Your clues are specifically where the cannonballs hit. And then mini boss time. Careful with the boat. Because then that happens. And yeah, that's the only boss that um, enemy or boss that that uh, does that to you, right? Yeah, the only the only actual boss that you know stuns you is King Knight. But if you're getting stunned by King Knight, <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Uh, I'm not using a massive pogo stick. Well, being a scrub is the correct answer. Yeah. Because seriously, it's. If you I can't mean, the first go on him. I mean, the first time, you know, it, it's understandable. You're learning that boss's pattern, but if you, if you still get, you know, either stunned that by or him, you're either that or you're learning the Poco jump. Yeah. Which actually did take me a while on the 3DS version. And now, you need to use the mobile gear here. I'm the sure that's secret I'm passage. Sure it's supposed to be metal Gear. <laughs> metal Gear. So how about that Metal Gear survive? It's bit. You know it's basically what? Konami. I. It, it, it's you know Konami what? being I Konami, wouldn't... and they're they're turning Metal Gear into literally the most generic thing uh, for this. Well, they're generation. just tr they're just trying. You to... know what? The, here, you know what? I'll quote something the Super Best Friend said. I'm not so much you know bitter and whatnot as it is. I'm surprised at how apt the it is to Metal Gear as a whole. It's basically Konami saying, "Look, see, look, stay with us." What do you mean, apt? I mean, if I, 
because because Metal Gear is basically a zombie series now. Yeah, they're turning into zombie it, survival it's a, it's co-op. The series is a corpse. It's a shambling corpse. Well, yeah. Ah, that that was terrible. <laughs> oh come on, there have been dude. Everybody's been making yeah, good everybody's jokes. been making jokes regarding the title. All right, so Metal Gear Survival. I mean, here's my. If I'm going to be completely honest. If there's one thing I'm o I'm okay with, it's the fact that all right, game game basically has no story because I I don't. <laughs> Uh, the last time we had a had a Metal Gear game that was wasn't written by uh, Kojima, it was uh, portable not ops. that good. Huh? It was portable locks. All the non-canon ones, i.e., portable ops, Ghost Babel, um, Snake's Revenge, those are non-canon. And the Acid series. Well, Acid was good. Metal Gear Acid. Uh, what are you on Acid? It's it's fan fictiony as hell in my opinion. Well, it's an RPG. It's Metal Gear trying to be an RPG. What do you expect? So here's why I'm here's my thing. Snake, are you doing acid? With regards, with regards, dude. He, do you have a Vita? Snake? Yeah. Yeah, he does. Okay, so one of you assholes are doing is doing uh acid. What's it? Wait, what's I'm it? I'm already doing this. I'm already doing the mainline series. I, wait, what's I it for? Like okay, I, have I say, Ow. I say no to doing acid for one reason. It it does one of the things that XCOM does, and I fucking hate it. Wait, what system is it for exactly? PSP. PSP. Oh, okay, yeah, I I have a means to record it because I got PSTV. But let me finish. Have you seen some uh, some shit regarding uh, XCOM 2? No. Of what happens in the fights? No. You could be point like basically point blank right in front of the guard. Oh god, this section. In front of like an enemy, and you and because it's not you know a, a shooter, it's um, a strategy game. You can fucking miss by means of oh, let me just point the gun at the ground. Ah. They don't do the same sort of thing in acid, but it's more or less the same. All right. Well, either way, one this... of you two are doing is doing acid because I'm already doing the main line. One, two, three, four. Snake Eater. Oh, sorry. One. Hold on. Let me look at the Legacy Collection. I have the Metal Gear uh, Legacy Collection as well as Ground Zeroes and Phantom Pain. So I'm doing uh, MGS One, MGS Two, MGS Three, MGS Four, and MGS Five. Uh, Ground Zeroes slash Phantom Pain. Uh, Peace Walker was the other one. I call Revengeance. Um, I already called this. I, I mean, I could give Portable Ops a Dude, shot since that one's on mission-based. I could probably play the game better. Uh, what Fable? game? Revengeance. Revengeance. <laughs> Revengeance. I could give Portable Ops a shot since that's mission-based. Dude, you don't- dude, character action games are my jam. <laughs> also, I really like this enemy type. What, the propeller knight? What the pro Um... This enemy with the propeller? Yeah. He's got I was a going propeller to say and the an propeller axe. knight, but the thing is, propeller knight's the boss. What the fuck are these guys called? I don't know. Uh, propeller knaves? <laughs> Nave. Nave, I say. And here we have another wind gimmick. It's going up and down, up and down. Your timing is based on how well you know it. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't have much of a problem with this. Though. Yeah, this one's not bad. It's the one oh, that's after what? this. Oh, the, the, it's after this that gets everyone shit. I have no problem with these win sections. Vertical, and then right. What's the section that gives everyone uh, shit with propeller night stage? I don't know. Probably the one where the wind's everyone, against you? Apparently people hate propeller night with passion. Ow! <laughs> the fuck? Knockback. 
not even gonna bother. No, I can't fish. Not with this wind. These are too high of winds for fishing, man. And I don't have the Ichor to magnetize myself. Should have at least got that for a coat for some rare instances. But anyway, here we have the Frenchman himself. She is beautiful, no? Yeah, 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 I was about to say, I always think of this guy as French. Gyroscopic jester. Oh, yeah, he is oh, French. He is French. Oh, was he not hospitable? They were not hospitable! <laughs> My, my shit. shit. He my was shit. that magnificent. <laughs> Dude, no, don't. <laughs> I'm... How are you not entertained? All business, no pleasure. Such a shame. <laughs> Very well then. On guard. <laughs> <laughs> even that la even that laughing animation is French. Oh god damn it! He's doing the Karen Konzuki uh <laughs> laugh. And then here is one of the best uses for the anchor on a boss fight. I learned this from watching John's review. Yeah, he's French. You saw the rose. Yep. Yeah. Well, he could also be Vega in disguise. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> In which case, he's a really nasty pervert. Anyways. <laughs> it, how, uh, but how about his net? He also speaks bullshit. Or how about Hisoka? So, yeah, I'm, I'm doing the, so I'm doing the mainline series. Um, I'm skipping uh, Metal Gear uh, hmm. 1 and 2. Because we don't need those. We don't yeah. need to worry about them. Especially since we can cover them uh, because MGS1 has, um, has the quick summaries. But, yeah. So, hey, here we I'm have covering... DC's favorite stage. <laughs> and then we're going to see everybody's most love gimmick. Hard when we get to the section. Yep. I will and I will join you <laughs> for once. <laughs> Do you know what the section I'm talking about is? Yep, we all oh, know I what know. it is. As soon as we see it, I'll <laughs> As soon as we see it, we're just, I'm just gonna do, gonna say groan countdown. <laughs> All right. Well, say so I'm doing MGS uh, Metal Gear Solid one, two, uh, three, four, um, um, and both uh, games of five Ground Zero and Phantom Pain. And I'm also doing um, fuck, I forgot what it's called. Um, <laughs> Peace Walker. Peace Walker. Uh, uh, Peace Walker, and uh, also Revengeance. That if I can record it first. <laughs> Fuck you, I'm doing it. And then we have Dude, new... I'm the Platinum guy. I'm <laughs> also, because I'm also doing Bayonetta 1 and 2. Yeah, yeah, but as soon as I can get the means to, means to do it, I'll, I'll be doing uh, Mad World, Anarchy Reigns, uh, Near Automata, um, what else is there? Uh, near, uh, depending on... Well, since I already have a PS4, I think it's on PC or, or PS4. Um, Not to mention, I'll, I'm going to be doing the first near as the, the RPG uh, stuff. Oh, I'm not sure if that's c completely a good idea for, some for like, doing the endings. I'd say, ah, uh, with regards to multiple endings, I'd say let's just, uh, do, go, uh the one pathway uh, that you want to do that you want no you have no if you want to get the full story and all that and everything you have to do the multiple one oh god how why, sure, why how do I feel is, like this uh, sounds like Shadow the Hedgehog huh? how long is doing all of the endings um I feel like you guys are talking about Shadow the Hedgehog but I know I... you're not I don't know I don't remember this is reminding me. I have to record Shot uh, the Hedgehog now. What's the difference? Is it the only difference the endings? Because if if that's the case, then you just do the pathway you want, and then you uh, get a clip. You of have all to the do endings. ending. You have to do ending A first, and then after that, you have to do ending B. Then you have to get all the weapons to do ending C and D. This... How long is that total play, play time? Uh, well, uh, get um, we're in the middle of commentary. Um, uh. 
figure that out and uh, get back to me, and I'll uh. and we'll talk about that because. We're not gonna get on that anytime soon, especially since you don't have capture card. This discussion just made uh, me yes. just reminded me of a horrible truth. I have to record Shadow the Hedgehog. What? Yes, you do. Uh, oh, this uh, park can go suck a dick. That's not that bad. Uh, just jump on the. Yeah, I don't like. I don't like this. I don't like this mechanic. I like the mechanic. So because... It's just how it's used. Right here is when it starts to get bullshit. Yeah, but that's not the part you really hate. Nope, uh, nope, nope. We're not there yet. We're not at the good part. Fuck you. We're not at the good part yet. It's yet to come. <laughs> Why do you keep using the face locket? Hmm? Why do you keep using the face locket? Because I can. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing most of the platinum. I'm doing the platinum games. So, uh, Bayonetta 1 and 2, um, uh, Metal Gear Reve uh, Rising Revengeance, uh, Transformers Devastation, and if I get really drunk, uh, TMNT and, uh, and Korra. Unless you want me to do TNT for you when I get it, <laughs> and yeah, have a means to record, TMNT. and have a means to record off HDMI. Oh, uh, God. Here we are. Hey, drone countdown. Wait, DC drone countdown. In three, two. This isn't that one. part yet. This isn't that part. This is just the opening section. Yeah, this is just the start. It's We're just the getting... beginning. All right, then you say drone countdown when we when you get to it, okay? Don't need to. You'll yeah, statues hear it. that statues that make you. No, I I want to. I need it to be simultaneous. <laughs> no, and this isn't that part either. It's just the second part. That's which part's is, easy enough. Which this part is not that hard. We're not there yet. Not yet. Guys, can we restart this? You gotta be kidding no, me. No, uh, you can just... No, I'll just cut it Eric out. Eric will just edit it out. I'll just it cut out. it out. Yeah, thank God there was silence. Well, even, th even then, you can just, uh, edit, uh, Eric like can just to... cut, uh, cut out your shit. Yeah, I could just edit it, that it out. It doesn't really matter if we were talking or not. Yeah. But yeah, that's the benefit of Audacity parts. Yay. We're still not at the good part yet. The good part is yet to come. <laughs> Apple. Guys, so, help me out here. <laughs> wait, so Eric, you're planning on getting TMNT? Uh, whenever I get the means to record off an HDMI, or if I I'd actually like to do wait, the um. What do you mean? You can, uh, you can just do uh, uh, PS4. Sh you can just record off PS4. I'd actually like to do some of the um, some of the PS2 uh, Ninja Turtles games. Or if I get a PS3, or if I get a big like the ones based off of the the 2003 show. Or if I ever do get another uh, PS3 with bigger memory, I could get the uh, TMNT There's also on that. Really good um, beat 'em ups. Well, like I said, I'm I'm basically until uh, you guys. Well, because uh, um. Well, I um. So yeah, I, uh, Snake. I rem I recommend if you are planning on doing PS2 games as well. Um, it, are you planning on doing it straight off a uh, PS2? I would have to. You don't have a PS3? I don't have a PS3 that can run PS2 okay. games anymore. Well, yeah, that that's what I have. So it works with the capture card I have. That works and the last HDMI. relic. So if you, I I recommend just getting the um, the Elgato Capture HD, not the HD60, the HD. 
We now have a complete uh, set of relics. That is an AV cable included that'll that'll allow you to record off of uh, PS3 and um, uh, retro I'll consoles. Just, I'll just um. That that is the best way to record off PS3. I remember we were talking about this, dude. Trust me, you do not want to deal with what I had to deal with. I will fucking do whatever it takes because right now I can only get one. Well, yeah, then, then uh, that's what I'm saying. Get the uh, get the um, HD. Just the but HD. I want to do. But I'm Here going we to are. Do fighting games that I have to do it in 60 frames. Wait, dude. Oh, is this the wait, part? Wait, hold on. Wait for it. Wait until we get. Wait until we can confirm. Oh, this part's easy. Yeah, um, this part. Well, no, wait. Nope. Snake. It's not it yet. Not yet. Uh, Snake, you can still do fighting games. Uh, like you, it'll still feed. Um. And then how about a little um, dragon it'll platforming? It'll still feed off at 60 frames. It just won't oh, record really? at 60. I'd like it to record in 60. Why? Because... Because I'm doing this like Maximilian does it. We're starting out! <laughs> you don't need to be that professional, damn it. We, you do realize we're doing videos at 720p, right? Yes, but, but Maximilian started out at, at 60 frames. <laughs> and I have no idea who the hell that is. A really, really cool, um fighting game uh, player on YouTube. We're not doing fighting games only! <laughs> okay. But I'm going to be doing fighting games. So? I have a way that I like to do things. Yeah, well, everyone makes sacrifices. <laughs> But yeah, um, well, it also depends on the game, because actually, like, it, um, uh, you might want to check the specs for the HD, but the HD actually, uh, the Elgato Capture HD, if I recall, it can go up to, I believe, 720, uh, uh 60 FPS, I think. Eh, uh, good enough. But yeah, just... I recommend checking on that. Daybreak behind the scenes. Check first, uh, before you get it. Yeah. Daybreak comes behind the scenes, as if you actually care, though. Behind the scenes. This planning our playthroughs. Comes. No, wait, no, planning our commentaries during our commentaries. Hey! This yeah. is, this is fucking Polar Night stage. What the fuck do you expect us to do except rage? I'm waiting mm -hmm. for that part, by the way. I well, I'm just going to grow. I think we're actually. I think it's not in this level. Huh? I don't think it's this level. Because we're. I think we're at the near end. I again. I can't. I can. I can never remember. We never remember. All. Actually, I think this is one of the parts. I Wait, think. Uh, this is this is pretty bad because of all the shit they throw at you. <laughs> the fucking birds, and you have to play. Uh, they're not even birds. Whatever. They're dragons. Dragons, dude. They're little shits. Whatever. And to most of this, I say fuck you, phase lock it. Yeah, it's not this level. It's the optional level for the uh, propeller dagger. Hey, Polar Knight. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the mountain. <laughs> We have Shovel Knight's Sandor Clegane. Saber. We have Sh Shovel Knight's saber tooth. Yeah. Actually, that is a pretty apt compar comparison, considering that sa that saber tooth is bi definitely bigger than Wolverine. Well, yeah. Even the wiki says it that Polar Knight is basically Shovel Knight's uh, saber tooth. Yeah, it was um? It sounds like I mi I missed the very beginning, but it sounds like they're they used to be close friends. Yeah, they have a history. The dialogue well, confirms all it. of them. I think all the knights um uh, had a history of Shovel Knight. No, I don't. No, not all the knights. Yeah, like Spectre Knight. Then uh, Spectre Knight doesn't. King Knight doesn't. Spikes, spikes everywhere. That's what you. That's what you hate about this boss. Fuck you, chaos orbs. Yeah. 
This is also where chaos orbs are handy. You lied. What? You said uh, you only used your uh, the relics once, and that was against Tinker Knight. Well, no, th I meant. Well, no, that by that I meant you know where a relic actually has use use for the boss of its stage. Uh, what relic did you get from this stage? Uh, for this one, I got that the blow horn. the war horn. What does that do? It basically, at the cost of twenty magic, you can. Uh, it's an AOE attack that, you can, uh, that basically you can, says fuck everything in your area. Yeah, you can basically blow out a wide radius attack. Why aren't you using it then? Because it's twenty magic. Admittedly, it is costly. Get the money. I am, but then, shield knight, gimme, catch. There we go. Okay, money. And then last upgrade. But for the most part, that ends off all of the knights of the order. All that's oh, left. The Tower of Fate. The Tower of Fate, the last optional level, and other optional stuff. Yay! Yep. All right. Goodbye, everybody. Now get the now get the rest of the shit uploaded to the drive, and we can meet up later again tomorrow. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Goodbye.